Chapter 29, The New Owner In 1792, Samuel Ogden, a colonel in the New Jersey militia, acquired all of what became the town of Oswegachi and other lands in northern New York. However, he could not possess them because the British continued to hold Fort Oswegachi. He had learned of the lands from his brother Abraham, who was appointed by George Washington, a commissioner, to obtain titles to the tracts from the Iroquois Indians. Colonel Ogden was born December 9, 1746, at Newark. Colonel Ogden, in a letter September 29, 1793, to Sir Guy Carleton, Governor General of Canada, said, On examining the tract of country which I own, I found the most wanton and excessive waste of timber imaginable, so much so that I conceive injury already committed to the amount of many thousand pounds. I found also a large sawmill building being built within two or three hundred yards of the fort of Oswegachi, which, if persisted in, will destroy the most valuable tract of timber in all that country. The mill was being constructed by Vern Francis Lorimier, a half-pay British captain. I shall not attempt to reason as to the right the Indians may have to those lands, which I am informed by the governor of New York, have long since been purchased of them, on the proprietary of the detention of the post at Oswegachi, or on the recent establishment of an Indian village on my lands. Ogden, in a memorandum written at Kingston, Canada, on September 23, 1795, directed his agent, Nathan Ford, Obtain possession of the fort and works. You will exercise your own judgment as to what repairs it may be proper for you to put on any of the buildings at the old fort. It strikes me that it will be best to repair the old stone houses and as many frame as may be found sound and free from decay. Samuel Ogden was a son of David Ogden, a Supreme Court justice and loyalist, and Gertrude Governor Ogden, daughter of Lewis Morris, a signer of the Declaration of Independence. He was one of their twelve children. Samuel Ogden and his brother Abraham were ardent patriots during the American Revolution, which Samuel aided as an iron manufacturer. Their brother Isaac, a loyalist, became a judge in Montreal, appointed by Lord Dorchester. Samuel Ogden's agent, Nathan Ford, dealt with Isaac Ogden for supplies, labor, and marketing for the new American settlement at Oswegachi. Oswegachi soon was called Ogdensburg for Samuel Ogden. Samuel Ogden's son, David Bayard Ogden, on February 29, 1908, received a quick claim deed, his interest in the town of Oswegachi, including Ogdensburg. Samuel Ogden spent his latter years in New York City. He died December 10, 1810.